Inhuman witch. Inhuman witch. Inhuman witch. <sighs> Thanks, guys. Inhuman Witch, 2016, written and directed by David Cornelius, starring Matt Lauman, Michael Peake, and Kayla Clark. At the height of the space race, a freak accident causes an astronaut to mutate into a carnivorous sloppy Joe that goes on a killing spree. The 2010s have recently become my favorite decade of cinema. Small studios could greenlight any ridiculous premise larger studios would scoff at, and digital effects had become cheap enough to be accessible for smaller productions. The 21st century also ushered in a revival of throwbacks to pulpy science fiction and horror of the 50s and 60s, of which this film is clearly satirizing. Satire can be extremely tricky to pull off if not approached properly. This film nails the tone perfectly and has a lot of fun along the way. The entire cast is hilarious, and execute their ridiculous lines with a perfect deadpan delivery. The script is beyond self-aware, and pokes fun at its own ridiculousness, as well as B-movie tropes in general, but it's all in good fun and played for laughs. The cast doesn't really consist of any well-known actors, aside from Matt Lauman, who has been a set medic for a number of films such as the Transformers spin-off prequel film Bumblebee, and shows such as Curb Your Enthusiasm, as well as doing voiceover work in Borderlands. According to IMDb, this film was made with an estimated budget of $2,030. The creature is brought to life using a combination of practical effects and digital compositing, which lends authenticity to the look of the film, while using new technology to accomplish it on a budget. The script stayed funny and engaging through its entire runtime which surprised me because a premise as simple as this easily could have dragged during its second act. I really don't have anything bad to say about this film. I had a blast watching it and was laughing the entire time. Verdict, highly recommended. This film literally had me howling at the screen. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling low-budget venture.